Since I'm from Chicago, I am a Bulls fan. So the legendary version, I think, the cover was MJ. So I'm pretty excited about that too. What's your my player? Um, I actually made a center because my friend told me that it was like the easiest to kind of. So you go the easy route. Yeah, I'm I'm new to basketball, so you know I'm just trying to do the easy stuff first. Pacers in the middle. 6 11, 24, Mason Plumley. At forward, 6 8, number 32, Kevin Love. Starting at one guard, 6 6. Number 17. At the other forward, 611. Number 13, Nikola Jokic. The other guard, 64. Number 9, MP. Of your home team, fans, that is your Indiana Pacers. Greetings, folks. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports for our latest presentation of NBA basketball. Brian Anderson here, joined by our analysts, Hall of Famers Grant Hill and Doris Burke, plus reporting from the sidelines, Allie LaForce. Allie, take it away. Hey, Brian. Nikola Jokic said, quote, Growing up in Serbia, I fell in love with basketball. Playing professionally at 16 years old, I developed fast. Now, when other players... Great stuff, Allie. Thanks. And the starting group for the Celtics. At the two and the three, Brown and Tatum. Then there's Peyton Pritchard. Then there's Robert Williams. And it's Williams in at the four. And for Indiana, Nikola Jokic is out there with Kevin Love. Then it's Mason Plumley. Then it's MP. And some new faces and new places this year, Grant. How long do you think it takes for a new player to fit in? Well, you know, some players never fit in. But depending upon the style, it varies from player That's to player. And even foul. from where we're sitting, you could foul. clearly tell it was a foul. That free throw, no good. For the Pacers, Mason Plumley And no luck that time either. Boston on offense. Up the floor. And they're on the run. Here's Jokic, and the dunk by Jokic. Well, that kind of assist will make you very popular with your teammates. Kevin Love is adept as a big man at putting it on time and on target. Here's Pritchard, outside Tatum. Inside, here's Williams, and the shot is good on the assist by Tatum. As pretty much any coach, that's how he'd like to start the game. And out of bounds, Boston will have it. Here's Pritchard, covered by MP. Pass to Williams. Outside, Williams. Just five to shoot. And he drops in the layup off the glass. And this is right in his wheelhouse. Hitting the boards and cashing in. Already, I mean, we are seeing the full range of a skill set on display. Get ready for a...
fine game from this guy. Offensive rebound. Three shots, three baskets. Great efficiency so far. What energy on the offensive boards. The defense can't match the effort, and they paid the price. Williams has gotten all three of his shots to fall. Three for three. MP, the pass to Jokic. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. You can't leave someone open on MP's squad because he's solid at recognizing the overcommitment. And the foul called on MP. That's his first foul. The Celtics have gone three of five shooting so far. Pass to Williams. Here's Pritchard. And he buries his first look. Just owning the painted area. If it's working, no need to change. Here's Rogers. Oh, deflected. MP finds love. And here's Jokic. Over Williams. Love for three. Connects from downtown. They immediately found their offensive rhythm hitting three straight shots to start the game. For Boston, they've gone four of six in the first quarter. Williams against Plumley. Williams passes to Tatum. Takes a 13-footer. He's off on that one. And Indiana will come the other way. They put up a nice win against Sacramento last time out. They were really able to exploit that defense. I mean, getting almost any shot they wanted. It was that easy. Give them some credit. I'll tell you this. They caught an opponent on a very off night defensively, and you take advantage. Simple as that. Here's Pritchard. And right now, he's currently putting up six and a half points per game. The kick out to Williams. No good on the three. Indiana has gone two for two from deep to start this one. In transition, here come the Pacers. What awareness from MP. When the break is on, he knows exactly where to go. And we're approaching about three and a half minutes played in this first quarter. Offensively, it's been a struggle for them. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Here's Brown. Ooh, they can't stop the run with that one. For Indiana, they've gone 5 of 5 in this quarter. Solid. MP, the pass to Jokic. Rebound Boston. They defeated Washington in their last game. Yeah, and that one came down to their rebounding. There was a big gap between the two teams there. That was a coach's dream, to get that kind of effort and intensity on the glass and for it to pay those kinds of dividends, critical. Here's Pritchard. An 11-point game for him in the win against Washington. Shot clock at two. Oh, MP with a block. Jokic passes to MP. Unable to get that one. Tatum with some nice D. Nikola Jokic grabs the miss. Jokic has got four rebounds now. Boy, we have seen Jason Tatum improve each and every year. Not just his productivity, guys. He's so skilled. But it's the leadership. It's the maturity for his age that's really striking. Now here's MP. Coming off a 16-point game against Sacramento. And he may have posed even more problems with his passing. They had to worry about him as a scorer and a distributor. Here's Tatum. Four-point game. Williams. And Williams punches it home. Well, you can tell there's a team-first mentality with the young gun Jason Tatum working to find the open teammate. Nice. Williams finds Williams. That ties the game. The value of good ball movement isn't lost on this squad. So it's the Pacers now. And Doris, Tatum's acumen as a playmaker now is leadership by example. Well, championships are won with unselfish play. His teammates have developed their games as well. This guy now trusts them and wants to make sure everybody's involved. Outside, Brown. Nikola Jokic grabs the miss. Jokic has got five rebounds in the game. And it's love missing. Well, we didn't see the same kind of control we're used to seeing from him. This guy is usually a tremendous finisher. To the inside. Williams' shot is good. Williams has got 10. That makes him 5 for 5 so far. Could be a big night in store. MP, the pass to Plumley. 
rebounded by the Celtics. Williams has got a rebound number five here tonight. Plumley against Tatum. And there's the call on Mason Plumley. That's his first foul of the game. Yeah, he tried to gain position, but couldn't quite get there. Young, he's checked in for Plumley. It's Brown on the wing. Six to shoot. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Boy, it is really hard. Checking in for the second. MP, the pass to Jackson. Outside for Brogdon. Back to MP. He got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. That's his second personal foul. And of course, Brown has talked about his love for the strategy in chess. That's what negotiating a CBA is like. <laughs> That's right. Takes a cool head, takes some patience. Every move has to be completely thought through. And you do not want to make a mistake because it can unravel your position. And the Celtics making a change here. Richard. Richards checked in. So the Celtics five right now. We've got Derek White. He's out there with Peyton Pritchard. And it's Williams in at the four. Young. And Young slams it in. Woo! Defensively, you can't afford to let him get to the rim that easily. Well, that might be why their deficit is what it is right now. I'll tell you, you can't get stops if you're unwilling to put in the work. Well, MP in the last matchup against the Kings was all business. He picked up 16 points, and his assist total was through the roof. He put up huge numbers last time out. We'll see if it's more of the same tonight. Guys? Good stuff, Allie. Tremendous effort from him in that last game, Grant. Yeah, B.A., I think he pushed them to the win through sheer force of will. Let's give credit to his teammates for continuing to find this guy. They knew he had the hot hand, and they were willing to ride it all night long. Boy, that's too easy to miss, but somehow he finds a way to do it. Tries again. The rebound, Celtics. Next up, the Knicks in New York. That'll wrap up this short two-game road trip. Pass to Pritchard. And that makes him three for four. He's looking good. That's been the story of their offense so far. Getting a number of looks from point-blank range. Outside for Brogdon. Now here's MP. Right side, Brogdon. Here's Duarte. Back to MP. Four on the clock to the middle. Jackson finds Brogdon. The Pacers again can't hit. Boston trailing. White for three. The rebound by Jackson. I think they could have got a better look right there. And he just a little over anxious, I think, to get that shot off. Cortez shot is good. Well, that's a nice play. You've got to read the situation and go to your floater game when necessary. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. Here's Pritchard. Oh, MP with a block. Got to commend the hustle from MP. Fantastic work staying alert on defense and coming up with the block. The shot by Duarte, no good. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. He just missed it. And block. That one goes careening off the glass. And they get it back. Pass to Pritchard. Now Williams. Out left to the wing. There's Neesmith with a three. Boston, no good that time either. Indiana's gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. Outside for Brogdon. A foul called on MP. That's his third foul of the game. Third foul in the half, and that's the risk you take leaving him out there. Williams has checked in for Boston. Here's Pritchard, covered by MP. To the right side. Here's Neesmith. Oh, the teardrop falls in. And the Pacers with possession here. They've only given up six here in this quarter. MP, the pass to Love. Back to MP. And Love with the basket on the assist by MP. Love's got five. 
See, I like when Kevin Love goes to his high percentage game on the interior. He has the size, he has the touch. White on the wing. Pass to Williams. Here's Neesmith. Here's Pritchard. He's got six. It's rebounded by Indiana. Jackson's got his fifth rebound in this one. MP with it. Down low. Tipped. And here's White. Here's Pritchard. It's tipped. Well, Kevin Love, such a smart defender. Send it back. Well, this has not been a quarter to remember for this guy. He looks completely flustered. MP, the pass to Love. And he comes up with a bucket. And now a 10-point Indiana lead. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stats for the Pacers. Well, in their first half of play, they're closing out aggressively. The block shots, a key indicator of their activity defensively. And you know, the other thing they've done really well tonight is stay active defensively. Lots of steals, and that's making a huge difference. Here's Pritchard, defended by Jackson. White against Brogdon. Outside White. No good with the triple. That's not his spot, but given the lack of defense, you'd like to see him knock that one down. Pass to Rodgers. On the wing, MP. Seven points in the game. Just five on the clock. Love passes to MP. Off with the layup. Boston's gone 0 for 4 from beyond the arc here in the second quarter. Williams finds White. Tipped! Oh, always fun to watch Malcolm Brown the guard. They set it back. And some changes here for the Pacers. Plumley's checked in for Brogdon. And Batadze subbed in for Jackson. The Celtics also with a sub. Jalen Brown, he's checked in for Neesmith. And here's Brown for three. And so the ball out of bounds. Brown touched it last. Nunn's checked in for White. Indiana's gone four of nine so far from the perimeter. MP drives in. Some solid defense from Williams. They can shave the deficit to single digits right here. That one drops for him. Richards got eight. Reliable approach. Getting the ball in the paint and going to work. Outside for Love. Pass to Rogers. To the paint. It's tipped. MP against none. Fires the three. Oh, it's blocked by Williams. Fast break. Here come the Celtics. And here's Brown for three. Drills it from deep. Now just a five-point Indiana lead. And when you're trailing in a game, it, it can be tempting to try to go for the big play. The drive by MP. Here's Plumley. That one doesn't drop. Some solid defense from Williams. Boston has gone just one of six from distance during the second quarter. Plumley against none. And a missed layup. The Pacers shooting a nice 50% for the game to the inside. And MP gets it to go on the assist by Love. Love's got his third assist of the night. MP's gone three of six from the floor. Outside, Brown. Back to Pritchard. Jacks up a three. Gets rebounded by Indiana. They've led by as much as 10. And after this one, they're at home against Phoenix. And that's the third game out of four at home for them. Love. Oh, he got it with a pump fake, but he couldn't finish. And for Boston, they're shooting only 35% so far. Here's Pritchard. Give him eight. Brown inside. Pritchard gets it to go. He's got 10. I think Brown demonstrating he's got a great understanding of the game. He keeps his head moving, his eyes open, so he can spot the open man. 
MP finds Plumley. Cash. Nathan it's Plumley. MP picking up the assist. And the Pacers lead by seven. Well, the Celtics shooting just 27% in the second quarter. Williams passes to Nunn. Chalk up two there. Nunn's got his first points of the game. This guy can do so much for you on the offensive end, and that is why his number gets called time and time again. Time called here. Indiana decides to talk it over. The Celtics, right? So it's the Indiana Pacers. Up. As we t-shirt time. And with the second half upon us, we'll find out if this game becomes the route that it's threatening to be. It's been a clinic out there by Nikola Jokic. Yeah, they've done an amazing job of creating room to operate for him. And then, of course, executing. Well, one of the things every player is after is efficiency at the offensive end. And boy, this young guy has done just that. Kevin Love out there with Nikola Jokic. Then it's MP. Then it's Mason Plumley. That's the five for the Pacers. Pre-shot preparation and catch and shoot is important. Jason Tatum on point. MP, the pass to Jokic. Misses from close range. Boston on offense. They trail by 11. Brown can't hit. Here's Rogers, defended by Brown. A nice shot by MP. Just an assertive play from MP down low. Getting around the contact and right to the bucket. About a minute played here in the second half. Pass to Tatum. The kick out to Williams. Clock at four. Late clock. The Celtics got to hurry here. Richard, no good. Indiana's got five of 11 threes to drop so far in this game. MP, the pass to Plumley. Some solid defense from Williams. For Boston, they've gone just one of three in the second half. Inside is Pritchard. Hits the layup after the sweet pump fake to freeze the D. Pritchard's got 12. That'll drive your coach crazy, failing to box out. Ugh. But to me, this is a common theme that's running through the league right now. Guys looking to leak out rather than box out. Takes a three. Rodgers misses. One for five has got to be a frustrating start, and they just don't look sharp right now. Can they find their offensive game? Is Pritchard. Had a chance there to cut it to single digits, but it's off target. The Pacers shooting 53%. Good efficiency on offense so far. He gets it in there. Well, that's just an impressive drive right there from Kevin. Puts it on the deck. Be the aggressor. Nice. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. Here's Brown. Solid shot from a distance of about 14 feet. He's got six. Oh, very clever how he creates space against a bigger defender. I tell you, the analytics crew may not like the mid-range, but sometimes you just got to put it in the basket. Tatum inside, covered by Love. And a miss there with a chance to cut the lead to single digits. For Indiana, they've gotten only two of seven shots to go in the third quarter. And it's Jokic missing. Boston's gone just one of three from deep since the break. Pulls it from the top of the key. It's hauled in by Nikola Jokic. They've done a great job of moving the ball tonight. Yeah, B.A., keeping everybody involved keeps everyone engaged. MP, the pass to Jokic. Rebounded by the Celtics. Williams has got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. Outside, Brown. 
Over Plumley. Boston, no good that time either. Well, if the defense gives him that shot next time, they could get burned. I think he's just a little bit out of rhythm. On target from range. <laughs> the unique passing skills of Jokic, just fantastic at realizing when one of his guys has a clean look at the basket. Oh, nice feed. On time and on target. MP, the pass to Plumley. Slam dunk by Plumley. Oh, nice one-handed jam there, B.A. Hey, little exclamation point. Here's Pritchard, covered by MP. Brown in the high post. He has six. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. Boy, you have got to appreciate how hard Jalen Brown goes. Amazing how he gets defenders to foul him when he's going up with his shot. And some changes here for the Pacers. Jackson comes in for Plumley, and Malcolm Brogdon is subbed in for Love. Here's Brogdon. The shot, no good. Good work defensively by White. Boston shooting just 36% in the third. Here's Brown. It's wide right. Hits off the rim. I'll tell you, no matter what he does, he can't find his rhythm, and you get the sense he's starting to press a little bit. The Celtics shooting only 35% so far. Little turnaround. White can't hit. Indiana's got six of 13 shots to go from outside the arc. Here's Brogdon. Second shot opportunity. Back to MP. To the middle. Here's Jokic. Ooh, tough break there. Shot after shot. They couldn't get anything to fall. Pass to Tatum. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. The confidence from this young gun. Jason Tatum's length is tough to deal with inside, guys. And so Tatum nails both of them. Two part equation. You have to be aggressive enough to get to the line, then talented enough to sink them. MP finds Jokic. Back to MP. Here's Rodgers. He's got five. The rebound, Celtics. Tatum's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Down low, deflects the pass. Stolen by Jackson. To the paint. Good, and the assist goes to MP. Jackson's got his first basket of the night. And breaking down some numbers here, the hustle stats for Indiana. Defensively, they've played with a high energy level tonight. And all the steals we've seen, a result of that aggressiveness. And you also have to give credit to them for their shot blocking. They've had a ton of rejections in this ballgame. Brogdon, the pass to MP. Here's Rodgers. Over Tatum. Doesn't go for him. Now Boston takes it the other way. Just hasn't found much consistency from the floor. But his teammates have picked up the slack. That's well, this is what they love seeing from Jalen Brown. The aggressiveness down near the cup. This guy's attitude tremendous. Brogdon with the ball. Now guarded by White. Brogdon, the pass to MP. To the inside. Jokic. Got a piece of it. And it's out of bounds to Indiana. Substitution on the court. Richard. Here's the floater. No good that time. Good D by Jokic. Indiana's got seven of their 16 three-point attempts to go in. And a look at the five for the Celtics to start the fourth quarter. The Celtics shooting around 35% for the game. He's checked by Plumley. 
to the middle. And it's MP with a rebound. MP's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Outside love. Right side, DiVincenzo. Shot clock at five. MP finds Plumley. 16 feet out. And he can't get that one. And Boston going the other way now. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Rejected by Jokic. Assertive defense from Jokic. Using all of his reach to get on top of the shot and deny it. Pass to DiVincenzo. Now here's Plumley. Cash. It's MP picking up the assist. MP's got assist number 11 for him here tonight. Here's Pritchard. And here's Nunn. Here's Williams. To the left side wing. Three-pointer. He buries it from three. Not the best three-point shooter in the league, but he's got enough skill that you can't just let him fire it up. MP, the pass to Jokic. Back to MP. Now here's DiVincenzo. Will not go. Misses off the front iron. Well, this has not been his finest hour, but give your teammates some credit for doing the job of stepping in. None. No good. Great rim protection to prevent converting. Beautiful. Outside love. Tries a 10-footer. That shot off. And the Celtics going the other way now. Shoots from the baseline. Pritchard, no good. The Pacers have got one out of six shots to fall in this final quarter. Not ideal. There's the steal. Great D that time from Jokic. And I'll tell you, they're going to need more from this guy if they're going to cut into this deficit. Love against none. Here's Jokic. And the shot goes in. And the Pacers lead by 17. And they keep on figuring out ways to force the rock inside and convert. Covered by MP. Inside. And the rebound goes to the Pacers. Right side love. MP, the pass to Jokic. To the inside, Plumley. That falls. Nice feed from Jokic. Jokic has got three assists in the game. Yeah, their defense is starting to wear down. That's three straight buckets. At the rim. And the Celtics call time here. Then with the offense reeling, coach has to get these guys on the same page. And to me, they're just taking too many tough shots. And when they do get an easy one, the confidence just isn't there. Boston with the ball. So far in the fourth, they've allowed just six points. Here's Pritchard. Pass to Tatum. Goes up on the baseline, and he gets the Jason jumper to drop. Tatum. Guys, this guy is a natural-born scorer. Jason Tatum finding his groove. MP with it. None in his pocket. Slam dunk by Plumley. He just rises up and throws it down hard with one hand. That is such a go-to move for him. He holds nothing back on those. Outside Tatum. And the Celtics have another three. Well, that's his second three of the game. One in the first half, one here. For Indiana, they've got four of nine shots to go in during this fourth quarter. MP finds Jokic. Again, the Pacers. Good for two more. We're seeing how Jokic can take over a game on a good night. He gets more and more efficient every season. Here's Williams. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. 
It goes on Mason Plumley. There's no debate there. He got hammered. They're finding a rhythm from the line as they try to cut into this deficit. And Williams drops them both. Staring at this deficit, they're trying to be more aggressive and get themselves to the line. MP, the pass to Plumley. Outside low. 4 3. And again, it's Indiana with a three. Well, the advantage they have right now is largely based on his play. What an outstanding night. Pass to Pritchard. Outside Tatum. Fires the three. And the rebound goes to the Pacers. Jokic has got rebound number 11. Right wing. The 11-footer. Second chance effort. The shot, no good. And Boston going the other way now. Here's Pritchard. Pass to Williams. The three is up. Four on the clock. Sinks the tray. Good passing to set that up. Teamwork on display. The Pacers have gotten six of their 13 shots to go. MP, the pass to Plumley. Blocked! Now here's none. He's guarded closely. Love grabs the miss. Love's got six rebounds now in the game. You have to credit their effort. I mean, they've done an amazing job on the glass. On the take. 13 feet out. Boston with a rebound. Williams has got six rebounds now in the game. Here's Tatum. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Tatum's got 15 points in just the second half. Boy, you love the aggression. This is where Tatum has improved, converting off the bounce. Pass to Rodgers. A little mid-range shot is up. Tatum pulls it in. Boston's gotten three threes to fall out of four attempts here in the fourth. Here's Pritchard, covered by Love. Here's Nunn from the arc. Plumley pulls down the board. Plumley's got rebound number seven tonight. Here's Love. Rebound Boston. Just a cold shooting night. Needs to try to make it into the basket. Now here's Nunn, tightly guarded. Covered by MP. Five to shoot. Laid it in with a nice touch off the window. Ooh, just selling the defense on the pump fake. Time called here. Indiana decides to talk it over. Lots to talk about here, guys. I mean, all right. Lose momentum and looking for answers. I think here you have just got to get back to what you do best and then live with the results. And now let's take a look at the New Balance player of the game, MP. And what's impressed me is how he's distributed the rock. I mean, he clearly wants to make his guys better. This kind of selfless attitude really improves overall team chemistry. It's evident that this crowd loves him. And with the way he's playing, it's easy to see why. He's really delivered for them time and time again. And it's the Pacers with the ball. Earlier in the game, they led by 19. MP finds Plumley. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. First team foul. In the second half, their free throw percentage has improved. Hitting in the low 80s now. He's off on the second. All right, here's a different question for you, partner. I'll be taking notes. Did you have a favorite city for food in the NBA? Well, write this down, B.A. So, my mom is from New Orleans, so I know New Orleans very well. And so, New Orleans was my favorite city, no question. The food there, uh, I'm getting full just thinking about it. <laughs> well, if he gets near the cup, Jason Tatum will leave no doubt. Woohoo! Here's Jokic. And once again, off the mark by Indiana. Boston's gone four of six from deep thus far in the fourth. Pass to Tatum. Here's Pritchard. 
Pacers with a rebound. Love's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Down low. Looking to win the drought. And MP with a layup. Inside the paint, MP plays with real heart, not allowing the defense to discourage him. Here's Tatum. No luck on that one. And Indiana will go the other way with it. Here's Rodgers. Hauled in by Brown. Boston trailing. Pass to Pritchard. Outside Tatum. The three. Counted from distance. Tatum's got 28 points for the game. Jason Tatum is the complete package on the offensive end. He can drive it. He can get to the mid-range. And now the three-point shot. Love grabs the miss. Love's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Two minutes remaining in the game. From the wing. And it's Jokic missing. I don't know if he's tired or what, but he is definitely holding back a little bit, and he has to step his game up right now. Just showing some tremendous authority controlling the boards. Love it. Wow, what a performance. And he's not just winning with physical ability. He's winning with anticipation. Brown passes to Tatum. Let's go with a three. Nikola Jokic grabs the miss. Jokic has got 14. Yep, 14 rebounds for him tonight. MP finds Jokic. Outside low. Back to MP. Clock at six. Pass to Jokic from deep. The rebound, Celtics. Every moment counts here. They have got to get moving. This is the very definition of desperation time. He's got to score every trip. That's about reading the floor. Hits his man right where he wanted it. MP to pass to Love. Back to MP. Now here's Jokic. Williams defending to the middle. Love against Tatum. Pass to Rodgers. Here's MP. It's deflected. And he's able to get it back. Two points. That one goes. And the Celtics call time here. Celtics call time. They trail by six. 36 seconds left in the fourth quarter. It's T-shirt from Nanta. Make some noise. Thirty-six seconds left to play in the fourth quarter. Unloads from thirteen, and the shot counts. He's fouled, and it's a chance for a three-point play. At the line for the Celtics, Jalen Brown, one shot. Free throw, no good for Brown. And for Jalen Brown at the free throw line, he has worked so hard on his mechanics, and that's paid dividends in terms of his confidence, guys. On offense, here are the Pacers. Earlier in the game, they led by 19. I'm watching the line there. It'll be a backcourt violation. And Boston calls time here. They're down by four. 26 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Fans, your base fans. A chance here to catch up with Allie from the sideline. Hey guys, the head coach of the Celtics had some instruction for his guys during the break. He said in the huddle, quote, we are in this game. Keep fighting. We win this one if we all play with 100% effort. Imploring his troops to stay aggressive. Guys. Great work, Allie. Thanks. Tatum can't hit. And that's an intentional foul. Yeah, and that was a smart move. I mean, you have to foul right there. You just don't want them to run out the clock. He drops the first one, and that puts him up five. Well, you think about the last few years and the evolution of Kevin Love. He's now become an elite stretch four, and he's got the green light on a nightly basis to shoot it from distance. Great. Back to Pritchard from deep three-point range. That shot off the mark. And so the Pacers take the win. Boy, they didn't...